contacted uh, Kyle to uh, see if his students would be available to produce a custom designed bench for the Lakeshore Nature Preserve on the UW Madison campus. Uh, most people are familiar with uh, Picnic Point, Eagle Heights, uh, Frouchy Point on, on, uh, on campus, and this is where our benches are going to go. Um, Kyle pulled together an incredible team of students to uh, create a design and uh, work through the pattern development and uh, produce what I think is a, is a beautiful bench that will be uh, located out on the, on the lakeshore of uh, Lake Mendota. The cast iron uh, ends will be uh, spanned by black locust uh, wooden slats that we've cut uh, on the preserve. So not only are we using recycled material for the casting, but we're using a, uh, a sustainably sourced wood product for uh, the remainder of the bench. It's an incredible project. Uh, I just witnessed uh, uh, the pour, and uh, it's an, a really technologically uh, sophisticated uh, program we've got here. I, I had no idea. <laughs> Uh, technologically, it was uh, it was the stuff we normally do. The course that the students were in that uh, they that were working on this project is the Metal Casting Two class, which is uh, deals with iron castings. And we've had help from all kinds of suppliers around Wisconsin and around the United States to uh, donate materials to this project. We use some of our software, our simulation software, to simulate the, uh, the metal casting flow. So we actually poured this casting on the computer before we ever, we ever actually went into the foundry to do it. Um, and it's the largest mold we've ever made. It's about 48 inches square, and the mold itself weighs about 1,600 pounds. The actual casting itself is only about 100 pounds, which is not the, the highest, uh, largest casting we've made, but uh, uh, the actual mold itself is hard to, hard to handle and move around. Uh, these students are excited to see their uh, something they made. Uh, they can come back years from now and, and um, you know say I, I had a part in making that.